Hey guys, Britta here. Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2019. Here we are back at Ravenport. Another episode, but we're at the BJ this time. 10.45. Um, you can see there's nothing in the bin at the moment. I have put uh, maybe four trailer loads in the bin already from down at the farm. Or oh, three trailer loads maybe, and dumped a trailer load here as well. So we're um, going to jump in this, this bad boy and do a bit of... Um, a bit of loading up today. Let's see how we go. Um, you can only put a total of, I think, maybe 50,000 in the bin at any one time. So, what I want to do is get our speed up to times five, maybe. Probably, possibly even times 15, I'm not quite sure. Maybe, I think Tom's 5 might be quicker, or quick enough I should say. I want to kind of keep, keep the silage up to it, but not, um, not have it empty out. What's the number now? 8,000, so yeah, maybe times 15 might be the best, but I'll just put this bucket in and another one, and then I'll have a look. So this is the mod, um, the New Holland W190D mod. You guys see me... Actually, I don't know if you guys see me purchase this, but um, it's the modded version. So you can change the wheels and all that sort of stuff. Um, and I've also got the 10,500 litre bucket, which is another mod as well. I'll put up the times 15 now. So I'm not quite sure how much money we're going to get out of this, but we've put an awful lot in already. And it's only more and more is going to go in. So one thing you can do, if you don't want to use a loader, you can use um, like the loading wagon and drive in here. And the loading wagon can and will pick it up off the ground anyway. So whatever you want to do, whatever whatever suits you, whatever's easier. I mean, I don't mind using um, using the front loader. Twenty-two thousand. So much is there when we get back. It's something we're going to have to, if we're going to do this um, regularly, you're going to have to come back and check on this all the time to make sure that we're not. Um, it's never empty. So come back, put a bucket in, and then you know go and do something else, and come back and put another bucket in. Whatever it is we need to do. Oh, what are we at? 28,000, so yeah, we're still a little bit ahead. We might bump it up the times 30 soon. I want to try and um, process as much as we can though before midnight, because we get paid for it at midnight. So anything that we put in after midnight, we'll get paid for it the next night. But I'm thinking we're going to get a pretty decent payday here. Oop, stuck on the wall. So I always get 10,492. Can never get the full 10 and a half. Not quite sure why, but... Oh, oop, I think I missed a little bit there. Oh, let's bump it up to 30. I mean, I don't... If you even, don't even have to put in the bin, you could probably just chuck it like on the ground in front of the bin anyway if you wanted to. Depending on how realistic you wanted to make it, I suppose. Do a bit of in cab view. It's kind of hard to see though. Oop. Can't see the numbers, can't see anything. Can't see the bucket. It's hard to see. Take it down. Okay, full bucket. I don't really like doing first person, especially with the loader. Right, so we're not far off now. Hitting midnight. Um, slow it down again. Let's 
slow it right down to make sure it's full at midnight. And um, hopefully we get some pretty good bloody income out of this. We need to um, pay off that loan of ours. It's it's massive. Um, I have heard though that the loans you can keep increasing the more land you have. I don't know if there's like a limit. Because we're at 790,000 already. I don't know if there's an actual what like, limit as to how much you can actually have. Right, let's speed it up a bit. Slowly drop out. There we go. 131,000 biogas plant income. Awesome. Heaps of money. Uh, 60,000 for leasing vehicle costs and property maintenance. Yeah, so we're going to have to start trying to buy all of our own equipment and stuff because our leasing costs are through the bloody roof. Alright, so how much have we got left in here? Probably heaps, I'd say. There are 65,000. Oh, no, don't do that. Alright, might go... Time 60. Top all this in, and I might jump in that um, tractor now and start... Bring it over in full trailer loads, just to make sure keep it as full as possible I'd say this guy's probably cost us an absolute fortune um, so let's have a quick look before mowers, if we can't go to lease, how much is it per day? 3800 per day, so that's costing us a little bit but the amount of work it's doing, it's hopefully going to pay itself back anyway Try and get a full trailer load. Might have to slow it down a little bit here. It's taken me a little bit harder than I thought. Uh, where's this? Yeah. Try and dump it so it's right down on the ground. Come on. Get it moving. Move. <laughs> we jammed it up. Not quite. This should be the easy way, but... Doesn't look very easy, though, does it? Alright, there we go. Come up here and turn around and come back the other way. So I don't know exactly how much I put in the bin, but... Whoop. 131,000. It's probably about four trailer loads or so. So it's still pretty good money, but... I'm going to start right down to times one now because I don't know how much is left in that bin. It'll be interesting to know how long it takes to go from full to empty, though. If we can work that out. That'd probably help us out a lot, too. Drop it down. Come on, there we go. Oh, stuck there again, so choose our muscles. There we go. It's at zero already, so it doesn't take long for it to go completely empty. Let's speed it up. Now stop. So two hour or two o'clock in the morning. We'll fill it right up. And then see how long it takes to empty. So completely empty though. Not yet. Now it is. Maybe hour 
Well, it's already half an hour, so maybe a couple of hours. Right, I want to quickly look at our fields, make sure. Um, still growing no weeds. Hopefully we won't get any weeds. It's an air in 10. Now at 20. Hour and a half. About an hour and a half. Obviously, maybe a little bit longer than that, but not far off an hour and a half. Let's try and get up and over here. Before, come on. Okay, beautiful. Should be, there we go, so should be picking that up. Come back up and turn around again. I don't have any grass at all in that side. I have cut the grass back at um, the farm. But it's still sitting on the ground. I've cut it, left it on the ground, so when I cut it again, we'll probably get like a double. Um, a double harvest, hopefully. I'll try and... Get all this picked up. So I don't know if this is easier or not. Well, using a front loader wasn't that difficult. It's probably easier using the body front loader to be honest. Go and drop this in. So we got a little bit of money. I did have to um I sold some of our cows actually to be able to afford to buy this land. So we're a little bit short on cows again. 15, I think we had 32, so I just sold 17 of them. Um, 5,000 litres of milk, so got plenty there. Should completely fill it. Beautiful. Or just about. Oops. Come on, get it all. It's kind of not doing it as good as I thought it would. When I left that grass on the ground, it actually worked a lot better than this. Alright, come on, let's get it. Why are you not picking it up? There we go. How much have we got left? 18,000. We'll slot back down to 30. Just to make sure. It's so hard to see. Alright, come on. Sort of just lifting it up and down, trying to encourage it to keep pulling through. There's not much left on the ground now, so... Oop, should be alright. Still can't see very well. Need some um, decent spotlights, I think. Don't know why it keeps getting stuck there. Shouldn't be getting stuck on anything. But it is. The tractor's stuck on something now. That'll help. Right, so we'll back him down. Right, start to unload there. I think that was nearly empty too, actually. Should hopefully be able to get the rest of it in this bucket. Miss that a little bit. Doesn't want us to get it, I don't think. It's 
It's like there's something there that isn't there. A massive hitbox. Uh, I wonder if it um, does what it did previously in FS17 where we can actually get out and just like empty it sort of thing if we can't pick it all up. So we can't actually get that bit. Can we go open silo? Um, okay. Alright, still says we've got a little bit in there, but I can't see any except for that little bit that's there. I don't think it wants to get picked up. Definitely doesn't want to. Hopefully that will disappear. Can we get around the back of this trailer? We can. Beautiful. Right, done. Six o'clock in the morning, so time's flying along. Right, I'll shut you down. I'll slow it back down again. Um. So you got a thousand left, you're completely empty. Let's see if you will like to pick this bit up. I don't think you will, but can't hurt to try. No. It's gonna be a stubborn bit of gear, I think. that up. Let's quickly drop you there. I don't know even if this guy will help. It's also 333 but literally can't move it anywhere. Okay. How much is in here then? 11.90. Alright, well, see if we can pick that up and chuck it in here. Still says there's silage in there. It's a little bit of a concern. Let's check all these fields quickly. Should be. Oh, still not even ready to harvest yet. So we'll bring this guy in, pick up this bit. Oh. See if we can dump it in this other side. It doesn't say anything about cleaning out the bunker, so... No, okay, it just doesn't want us to do it. Um... Can't pick that bit up. It's a little bit frustrating. So I so said I know previous episode, previous series, we had the same sort of thing. Um, we could never empty it properly to be able to refill it. So okay, you won't let us do that either. A couple of chaff straight in there. Looks like you're going back into here. We're going to try and pick this up. don't think we're going to be able to get it. There we go. Let's throw it in there. I don't care. I don't care where it goes. Um, I'm going to try around this side. I don't think it'll help, but... You just never know, I suppose. Nope. No, 
it definitely doesn't want us picking it up. It's really frustrating. One tiny little spot. No, we can't get it at all. Hmm. Alright, well I guess we're going to have to wait. Um, report it to Giants and see if they've got a way to fix it. Right, so I want to head back down to the farm now and work out what's going on down there. Drop you off. I'll oh, have a quick look. Where's our money? We've got... Uh, biogas plant, 131,000 income. Awesome. Um, harvest income. Does it give you... Oh, there you sold land. Okay. Definitely need to try and head up there now and... Um, see, I don't think we're ready... Not yet. Not ready for harvest. I'll hook this up and I'll show you guys. Here we go, biogas plant. So here we can sell normal grass. Uh, straw, I believe. You've got silage for 500. You've got 500 for manure and liquid manure 400. So you could possibly um, load this thing up. Maybe. Can we load this thing up with manure? Wouldn't think so. No. We definitely need to start buying some equipment and stop leasing everything. We're going to need a lot more, a lot more grass by the looks of it to keep that full. Said so I've already um, mowed around down here, so just got to pick it up. Look at all this. Still not ready yet. I'll right, we'll speed her up. Hopefully get ready soon. It's dark green. Our trees are still still growing. They're a little bit bigger than the way they were before, but still not fully grown yet. This field's taken a fair while. Make sure there's no train coming. Turn him on. Oops. It was down the whole time. I might as well start picking up this grass while we're waiting. This this to grow, our um, sunflowers. So it's, it's taken a while. Ready to remove the tops over here. Let's have a look at our loan. Can we... No, we still can't borrow anymore, so 790 must be the absolute maximum. Right, there we go. Slow it right down. That should all... It's all good to go. Actually, we're ready to harvest again. The grass. Could have just left it in mode again. Which I might actually do that. Right, so I'll stop you there. Uh, jump into you. Back you up, ready to go. So we'll bring the mower over and start mowing again. Here we go, sunflowers, high worker. Let him do his thing. Shouldn't need plowing. So we only just plowed it. Hmm. Unless we have to plow it. Each time we do sunflowers and stuff. I'm not sure. Let's have a look here. Um, harvesting. Yeah, root crops. Also radish. Approving yield. Uh, where's ploughing? 
Yeah, it doesn't say. Advanced knowledge. They're there, but it doesn't say that. We need to um, do it each time. It might be a, it might be a new thing. Drop in you, get you going. Should just be able to follow my tracks that I cut last time, except for through here, of course. So he's going to turn around and come back down. Going to improve our grass yield. That actually takes away part of that field there. That is kind of um, annoying though that we have to plough again. It's a real pain. Might have to look at buying a um, subsoiler or something. Um, what sort of power do we have? 300 horses, okay. Turn around this way. Careful not to hit the sunflower because I'm pretty sure we will mow it. You can mow crops with a mower and it will turn into straw, but you won't get the wheat out of it or barley or whatever. So you need to be pretty careful. How's he going? It's gone two strips. So I want to try and keep on the same sort of path what we've already done. And there's big piles of grass, which is which was weird. Like we're sort of mowing spots over here where it was uneven ground, uneven terrain, and it was like it was um. It couldn't spit out the grass, so it kind of held it in until we um, got on like a flat bit of land somewhere, and then it spat all the grass out in one one big chunk. All right, so he's going all right. Um, let's have a quick look before we go too much further. Subsoilers. It's only four meters. Mm, okay. That's 420. We don't have 420 horse. We've got 300. HR 4004. I don't even know what that is. BTF 400. Okay, let's have a look. HR 4004. Oh, BTF 400, which... Okay, you can plant after that. That would actually be pretty interesting. Subsoil and plant, and that goes to a TF1512. Alright, let's buy you. So we need to get BTF4000. TF1512, which is just more seed, which I don't think. Actually, yes, we do need because it has no seed in it at all. Okay. Buy you and buy you as well. Awesome. How's he going? He's doing all right. So we'll have to head down and pick that up. Nearly got a full grain tank. All right. Well, um, you can disconnect from there. I'm not going to use you anyway. I'll use you. Definitely got a lot more pulling power than that other little tractor we got, so. Use you to unload this harvester. Hopefully, won't go too much further. We'll be able to stop him before he tries to turn around. Right, stay there. Good boy. Um, I 
just to save time. I think I might reset you. Not that I really want to, but... So you can come back and pretty much get started straight away on re replanting. Would you stop? No, you won't stop. Okay, never mind. I'll jump out, jump into you. Okay, so what we want to do is grab. You first. There we go. You should go on the back here. Let's have a look. So, turn on sower. Oh, grab seed tank. That looks pretty cool. That is very interesting. Now that kind of connects from there to there. That's awesome. So that'll plough, cultivate and seed all in one go. Shame it doesn't fertilise as well. Select seed, which you can't even see at the moment. So we don't have any in here. So that did cost us a little bit of money, but I mean, I feel like we need to definitely need to start buying things and not hiring things anymore. We might be able to. Empty that other cedar out and fill this one up. We we'll probably get rid of the other cedar too, but it's um only reason why I haven't. It's a lot wider than this one. Six or oh, six meters. It's only two meters, so it's really not worth it. We'll get rid of the cultivator too, I suppose. That'll save us a little bit of money um, what, each day, I suppose. The plough, we could probably get rid of the plough as well. That'll save even more money. I mean, I don't think it's going to save us a great deal, but you know, any saving is better than no saving. Oh, those trees are going to look good once they're up and ready to go. This train is hooking through. I don't know if we'll beat him. We'll try. Ooh, yep, beautiful. It's missed a bit again, but you can see how thick that grass is now. Pretty much doubling what we cut before. So I think I might have to just dump this guy off for a second. down to there. Don't know how much seed we have left. 1930 so... Um, open cover. Unload. Can we unload? It's not letting us. Hmm. Alright, well, the next thing I'll try is drop you off, pick you up, see if you allow us to dump it, oh, it doesn't say anything, maybe do that, open cover, no, nothing, it won't let us empty it, okay, Right, well, we'll return you, return you, and return you. Which is a shame because it has seed in there that we could have used, but anyway. Pick you up. Might shut you down for a second because we're short on fuel. 
go and unload this guy. Work out where the best price for sunflowers are. How full is he? Full enough yet? Not yet. There, now he is. Good on ya. It's kind of missing, but that's alright. Um, let's go. Sunflower. 2393. Central Grain Elevator. Good price. Come on, 23. Of course, we just missed it. There we go. Get it full. While that's happening, let's quickly cycle through. So we can at least fill you up before it's finished. Which is finished now. I don't know if you'll keep moving, but I hope so. I think they're fertile. Yeah, they're fertilizer, so we need seed. We're going to use wheat, barley, uh, oats, canola, or soybean. We might go uh, canola again. Cover on. Uh, lower you down. Shouldn't do. Too, oh, get rid of our grass, but oh well. Oh, yeah, you. That is pretty cool. Alright, get out of here. That should be. Yep, harvesting. Um, and seeding. Yep, perfect. Don't know if I'll have enough to do the whole thing, but we'll find out. So it's not quite full yet. Why well, don't swing around and. Try and get him full. There we go. Is that in the right spot? It is. That's as full as we're going to get, I think. I'll go and dump this load off and come back. See more decent money for us. Um, how are our animals looking quickly? Good and good. Yeah, both good. A little bit of clean up to do, but I don't know, they're not doing too bad. We still need to replace those cows we sold. I think we need to get another 17 cows, but we'll get there. So hopefully you guys have been um, enjoying the series so far. Definitely um, enjoying playing Farm Sim again, especially FS19. It's pretty cool. Um, some people are saying there's not much different to 17, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I feel it is. Um, Graphics-wise, it's a little bit better. Um, the shop stuff is pretty cool. I really like that. Um, the way that the vehicles you know, handle, bounce, and all that sort of stuff. And even, I think, when you like use your vehicle enough, I think you yeah, damage the paint as well, like we did with that bucket. You damage the paint, and it's not until you get it fixed that it actually repairs everything. So, the damage on the wear and tear, and also the uh, paint and that sort of stuff. So, there's definitely a few big differences between this and FS17. Did we knock both over? Well, we did. So, yeah, it's, um, it's pretty cool. I don't think we're going to have enough money to buy that field back because it's got potatoes or sugar beets or something on there which would be pretty cool to harvest. I haven't done that yet but that'll um, cost us a fair bit and take us for forever as well I think. All right, tip you off, come forward, tip you off as well.
Money is certainly going up. Beautiful. You chipping in as well. Look at that money go. It's going to be a very good harvest, this one. Seventy-three thousand, and we're still not completed. I do have some of you guys may or may not know. Um, I do have the increased yield mod on, so I think it doubles doubles our yield. Slow him down. We'll head back. Don't think I haven't. He hasn't come up with his need and emptying again yet, but. Oop, 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 oop. Might be on his last run. We're close to it. Mower's still there waiting for us to come and finish it off. Oop, slow down a bit. Oh, I knew that would happen. It always happens trailer and the truck don't like going over at the same time. Ooh, watch out for those humps. So I'd say we might be lucky to get 100,000 out of this. If I can get in the right spot to unload the bloody thing. Alright, actually shut you down. Might not then, actually, because I don't think it's even going to be a full trailer load. But next one. Alright, we'll go and touch up these bits. How's our subsoiler fella going? Still working. So we're definitely making progress. It's taken us a good 17, 18 episodes to get decent income again but um certainly getting there just miss that little bit it's really I don't even know if it's even really worth it to be honest it's got 3.4 hours on it so Definitely use this guy. Could be another reason why our payments are so expensive. Because of how much we've actually used it. Paying the original hire fee, the daily hire fee, and then like the hourly hire fee too. He's definitely definitely getting there slowly, but it's getting there. So we'll bring this down and um, drop this header off, maybe like over here somewhere. Oop, jeez, that was close. I can fold you up now. Hook you up, turn you off. Alright, I might as well take you up straight away see if we can turn this around a little bit I think we might um, bring this up to say here drop them off, hopefully they don't go anywhere so it'll be a quicker trip without them you were expecting me to go then weren't you? If I had off, there would have been a huge collision. Just looking at the back of that um that last carriage on that train, I reckon we could actually like stick like, a car on it or something and get it from one side of the map to the other. There's our timer. Alright, so we'll head on up, empty this one out. 
and um, we'll end the episode here, I suppose. Another pretty productive episode. We've got plenty of money out of the BJ, 131,000. Um, we've got more that went in, so more income again tonight. Um, we've got like 75,000 so far from harvest. 73. Oops, slow down. See how we go. Oop. Surprised there's no horseshoes or golden nuggets or something to find. Wouldn't say for um, to get like a million dollars like you had in the past, but just for something. So what's that? Ninety four thousand. 96, 90, million 97,000 out of that harvest. That is pretty bloody good. Right there, guys. If you enjoyed this episode, as always, hit the like button. As I've said in every other episode, too. If you've got any ideas, anything you'd like to see, leave it in the comments section and um, I'll do my best to bring it to you guys. And um, if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet and want to see some more FS19, make sure you hit the subscribe button. It's been pretty great. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.